Konnichiwa! Here we are, on the fast and very technical track of Suzuka, characterized by abrasive asphalt and where the tires are subjected to a vertical load of more than 800 kg. To ensure the right combination of performance and durability, Pirelli has decided to bring the hard and the medium compounds to this race. But how are the compounds used on tracks developed? After the simulations in the labs, the finite element analysis and the different indoor tests that put the tire through the hardest conditions, the testing phase on track is essential. For this purpose, Pirelli has two excellent test drivers, Lucas De Grassi and Jaime Gersuari. It is their job to evaluate the prototype compounds developed by Pirelli. This is done at specific testing sessions with our test car, the Lotus Renault 2010, that has been modified to follow the latest Formula One regulations. After having tested the different prototypes, the drivers express their subjective evaluations regarding the different driving characteristics and the behavior of each prototype, explaining to our on-track engineers how the tires could be improved for the future. The use of two test drivers provides the engineers with two different points of view and opinions. This is essential to develop tires that correspond to the driving styles of 22 different drivers. The tests take place at different circuits, so that the tires can be submitted to several types of stress they will undergo during the season, even if a certain amount of unpredictability will always remain due to the combination of different conditions which cannot be reproduced on track. All comments and the feedback collected during the development tests will be analyzed and cross-referenced with the telemetry data acquired by the sensors mounted on the test car. So, Pirelli's tires are only ready to get on track at the end of a long development process.